it means that I not only do I try my hardest on my schoolwork academically, I try my hardest on my God-given talents, such as drama, singing, or dancing, and just everything. So, being a Panther means having kind of like being dedicated. A lot of us. For like with sports and everything, we're committed to it and we kind of like, we, everyone wants to do good. A lot of people at our school are very competitive and everyone wants to just like do great and everything and try their best. Being a Viking in my opinion means that you're doing everything in the high school's name and everything that you do out and about in public is, has to be with respect and stuff. And being a Viking also means that you just have the support of everyone around you and you can always have someone to turn to because it's just like, the Viking. It's just like always around you and the student section like Viking Nation is just someone you could always hang out with and it's just it's a great time. <laughs> to be a Laker means being part of a community or a family that not only betters itself and its environment but prepares students for the best opportunities. To be a satellite, it's kind of a sense of we're, we're a really small school, so it's kind of we're all there to support each other. We can all be there for each other, and it's just we all get along, and we're, we're just a little community, so. <laughs> well, togetherness, really. When you're a block of, when your mascot is a block of metal, um, you gotta be together. You can't have any cracks in that, or you won't, it won't work together. So to be an ingot, it really means to be together, to be strong, to be ready for anything, to be prepared. Yeah. You know, we, we, we take it very seriously, you know, with all the, you know, whether it's pep rally or whether it's homecoming, um, it, it's very serious. So um, I think it's just, it's a common, you know, common pride that we all have is uh, being, being a Crumpling Bulldog. So. Yeah, it's awesome. You create friendships that you can't create at high school, and you create friendships with not even your teacher, but like all teachers around because they are involved in every class, even if it's not their major or anything. They're involved. It's awesome. A center is just like a person in charge, really. Like we're just in charge for everything. We all have to go to all the games, you know, it's like much pride. We're just, to be a Mustang, we're just kind of all like a big family in a way and we all have like our herds and like even though we're supposed to represent being like freedom and being wild because we're Mustangs but we're all we're all really connected because it's such small of a town that we all feel like a family. Michigan City is very diverse and I think that's important because you get to meet a lot of different people and in, in the real world when you go to get a job like you're going to be dealing with a lot of different people and that's something that Michigan City has that I'm very proud to be a part of. It means a lot of different things to me. Mostly it's supporting people. It's supporting not only your school but your community and the teachers who are putting everything out there just to teach you. Your coaches, your students who are there for you, who are supporting you, going to the games, just seeing other people. Maybe you don't talk to them every day but you're there and you're supporting everything they do. A slicer is just someone that's like willing to be different and stand out and do what it takes to be successful. What does it mean to be an oiler? Okay, small school, small community, everyone knows everyone. It's so close-knit, it's like a huge family in the whole city. The mayor comes to our pep rallies, he's so much fun. He comes to uh, a lot of events and everyone knows everyone, it's great. We all are, we're all like a huge family. To be an oiler, is to be proud of living so close to the refinery, even though it smells so bad sometimes during the school day. But it's amazing to be able to be funded by BP and have their support and the whole community support every day. What does it mean to be a part? A part, it's really my life right now because, well, I got there in six, I got it in Miraville in sixth grade. But high school is, I, li I literally live there. And I love being a pirate. It just, and I love all the teachers, the staff, my friends. I don't know if I would, I, I wouldn't want to go to another school in Indiana. We have like a quote in the back of our lobby and I wish that I knew the whole entire thing, but like it's talk, it talks about how like without your pack, you're like nothing. So it's like in order to be a wolf, you have to have the pack behind you, so. Pestogen is a smaller town and so everything is more linked together. The community's closer and you know, being at the high school, you kind of know 
more people than if you went to a school in a bigger city, which I think is really interesting. And you know, there's uh, you know like small town events that you know bring the community closer. And I think just going to high school here is a unique experience that uh, people from larger cities wouldn't get. What does it mean to be a bricky? It means to put work in the everything that you do, try your hardest, and always want to succeed no matter what you're doing, whether it's school, like extracurricular, like community service, anything. Uh, it means to have pride in your school, um, give it all 110%, work hard, and uh, leadership, teamwork, everything. Just give it all for your school.